spreading across northern Michigan about ice caves that Mother Nature has formed over the last few months of our cold winter. Today, meteorologist Christina Burkhart went out on the ice of Lake Michigan to see this spectacular sight. Sights I've never seen before in all my life, and I've traveled the world around. Just north of Leland, ice caves have formed along the eastern side of Lake Michigan. The caves are formed by the wind and wave action. Westerly winds push slushy ice up along the shoreline. Layer after layer freezes on top of each other and forms this. Caves up to 30 feet high. When you're, if the sun uh, comes out, it's just this beautiful uh, hues of blue. It's, uh, it's like a winter, it's a magic wonderland. Waves not only carve out spectacular crevices and caves, but the freezing spray creates icicle-like formations. Once the wind calms, more sheet ice is formed on the water, and when it picks back up, the waves push the broken ice pieces together, creating an angular ice sheet that you can walk on to see the caves. These were something special. I've never seen anything like it. They were as big as a garage, cliffs of 20 and 30 feet. It was pretty special. To all intents and purposes, it looks like you're in one of the polar caps. Uh, there's just huge uh, looming uh, pieces of ice, uh, sheets of ice like gigantic sheets of glass. Um, and there's just miles and miles of these caves um, offshore uh, that you can explore. Reporting on the ice of Lake Michigan off of Leelanau County, Christina Burkhart, 7 and 4 News. Wow, that is awesome. That is really impressive. And to see the... The, the stalagmites and stalactites kind of formation right. of these icicles are forming. That, that's really cool. Okay, so exploring ice caves is apparently all the rage in Michigan this winter. They certainly have the weather for it. Ice caves have formed all along the eastern side of Lake Michigan. The wind and waves work together and create these beautiful things. Uh, layers of ice freeze on top of each other into huge piles, and some of them get as much as 30 feet high. I've never seen before in all my life, and I've traveled the world. 